Etymology and Historical Origin of the Baby Name Roger Roger comes to the English-speaking world via the Old French, Frankish, name Rogier, which originated from the Germanic elements rod meaning fame and gar, ger meaning spear. The Normans adopted the name and introduced it to England after the Norman conquest of 1066. Roger would eventually replace the similar Old English masculine name HRG with Macronar, a name of Anglo-Saxon, Germanic, origin with the same root etymology. HRG with Macronar was the legendary 6th century Danish king immortalized in the 8th century Anglo-Saxon epic poem Beowulf, depicted as a brave and victorious warrior and an honest and generous ruler. Beowulf and his men are rewarded with treasures and loving gratitude by HRG with Macronar after they defeat the monster Grendel and Beowulf becomes like a son to the king. The poet says that no man who wished to speak the truth could find fault with HRG with Macronar, that none e'er condemneth slash who willeth to tell truth with full justice. Clearly, a pretty upstanding guy. For more famous Rogers, see historic references below. Roger became a very common boy's name in medieval England and is ranked up there as one of the longest enduring, most time-tested names in English history. This name is also used in France, but pronounced R-O-Z-H-E. Other variations of Roger include Recker, Dutch, Rudiger, German, Reggiero, Italian, Rohr, Norwegian, and Rogerio, Portuguese. In more recent years, the name Roger has become heavily used in Catalonia, where it's ranked on the top 20 list of most popular boys' names. Roger has deteriorated in usage among English speakers since the late 20th century, although he will forever maintain a position of long-lasting significance. We'll leave you with one more interesting factoid, Roger was used as a slang term for the male penis between the mid-17th century and the late 19th century, most likely in reference to the name's potentially phallic meaning, i.e., famous spear. In more modern times, to Roger is colloquial speech for having sexual intercourse, as in he gave her a good rogering. It's all in good fun. Personality of the boy named Roger The number 9 personality represents the completion or ending of the cycle, and a need for perfection. This is the personality that moves from self to a greater understanding and compassion for the human condition and the world order. They want to make the world a better place. Nines are capable of great spiritual and humanitarian achievements. They are courageous and fearless, able to fight great battles on behalf of worthy causes. These personalities will not tolerate injustice. They are compassionate people with a strong sensitivity to others. They are able to both educate and inspire. Friendships and relationships are the lifeblood to the nine, and they place a high value on love and affection. Nines are often exceptionally gifted artistically, and they have a keen imagination and enterprising mind. Popularity of the boy named Roger Roger has enjoyed a long and illustrious career on the American male naming charts. That is, until very recently. The U.S. Government has only been tracking naming trends since 1880, so our data only goes back that far. In the late 19th century and at the turn of the 20th century, Old Roger was used with relative moderation. It wasn't until 1921 when he finally landed a spot on the top 100 list of most commonly used boy names, and he would hold a position on that list for the next 55 years. The height of Roger's popularity came in the 1930s, 40s and 50s when he was a top 50 choice. The name reached its apex at position number 22 on the charts in 1945. By the mid-1970s Roger was showing signs of age, and by the 1990s, this name started to drop like rocks. Considered outdated and old-fashioned by today's naming standards, Roger has deteriorated to a low-moderate position on the charts. In fact, today Roger is at his lowest ranking ever. We're not sure why, it's a bit perplexing actually. Roger is a strong and confident name, mighty like a spear. It's one of those names that have become so uncool today, we might even argue the opposite. There are scores of famous athletes and musicians bearing this name, including the tennis great Roger Federer. 
We also like the nicknames Raj and Hodge. Roger is a great choice for Anglophile parents and those who appreciate history and tradition over fleeting fashions. It takes a brave parent to buck the trends and go with a name like Roger. Do you understand what we're saying? Roger that. Quick facts on Roger. Gender, boy. Origin, English. Number of syllables, 2. Ranking popularity, 558. Pronunciation, R-A-H-J-R. Simple meaning, famous spear, renowned by his sword. Characteristics of Roger. Philanthropy, intuitive, idealistic, independent, perfection, oneness, multi-talented. Cultural references to the baby name, Roger. Literary characters of the baby name Roger. Roger Rabbit is the title character in Robert Zemeckis' hilariously enchanting 1988 live-action slash animated fantasy, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, itself based on Gary K. Wolfe's 1981 novel, Who Censored Roger Rabbit. Roger, a star at Maroon Cartoon Studios, suspects his wife, femme fatale toon, Jessica, is having an affair with the studio mogul, the very human R. K. Maroon, and hires, human, private detective, Eddie Valiant, to check out his suspicions. Then Maroon turns up dead, who done it? Featuring guest appearances from the likes of Bugs Bunny to Betty Boop, this romp pays tribute to the film noir of the 40s, and to one of its later-day adulators, Chinatown. Eddie Valiant, in the course of his investigation, is required to revisit, gasp, Toontown. Roger Rabbit is a delightful fellow with a knack for saying and doing the wrong thing at the wrong time, but we root for him all along, because he's just a regular fellow, a good guy, and above all, a decent tune. Roger Chillingworth is a major character in Nathaniel Hawthorne's 1850 classic, The Scarlet Letter. In the old world, Roger Prynne sends his much younger wife, Hester, ahead of him to the new world, while he stays behind to finish up business. Being delayed by several misfortunes over the period of two years, he arrives in Massachusetts, only to find that she has obviously betrayed him, and has borne a child in that time. He changes his name to Roger Chillingworth, assumes the role of community doctor, and begins his years-long search for Hester's partner in crime, whose name she will not reveal. Thus, he morphs from a respectable businessman and loving husband into the very symbol of evil as he ages and becomes more and more deformed as the thirst for vengeance drives him further and further astray. Roger Chillingworth has long been heralded as one of literature's all-time bad guys, but in our estimation, he really got a bad deal. He, after all, is not the one who was the adulterer. He is not the one who dallied with another man's wife and sired a child out of wedlock. He is not the one who keeps that secret for years and years. Indeed, Roger makes it his life's purpose to find out and punish his enemy, and becomes a dark force. Nonetheless, when Hester's erstwhile lover finally makes himself known, on his proverbial deathbed, we might add, Roger actually repents his earlier trespasses and goes to his own eternal hereafter in peace, having repented and having left his considerable fortune to Hester's daughter, Pearl. We'll call it a draw. And assume that he finds a better deal in the next world. Roger Hamley is an important character in Elizabeth Gaskell's novel, Wives and Daughters, first published in serial form between 1864 and 1866. Roger is the younger son of the squire of Hamley Hall, where the heroine, young Molly Gibson, a widowed doctor's daughter, stays for a while. He becomes an intellectual mentor to her, and, when Molly's father is entering into a remarriage about which she is concerned, Roger urges her to think of others more than of herself, advice which young Molly takes to heart. She also finds herself falling in love with him, all the while knowing that she is beneath his station in life. Roger, although the younger son, of whom less is expected than the elder, actually outperforms his brother, who is profligate and deceptive, one little case in point, a secret lower-class wife and child in a little hideaway cottage. Roger excels at university and goes on to join a two-year scientific expedition to Africa. Before he goes, however, he asks Molly's stepsister to marry him upon his return. Steadfast little Molly must swallow her heartache, which she does, due to all that excellent mentoring. 
The stepsister rides out a scandal, marries someone else, and leaves the field open for Molly and Roger. Roger now realizes he has always loved Molly but feels unworthy of her, after having squandered his affections on another. He confides his feelings to Molly's father, who heartily approves of his intentions, but Roger, alas, who is slated to return to Africa, falls ill with scarlet fever before he can speak to Molly, and hereupon misses. Gaskell died. Yes, that's right, the authoress. Well, others, including the BBC, finished it for her, but we're going to let you do the same. Popular Songs on Roger A song by main source, Roger, Roger That, a song by Neil Young, Watch Roger, Do His Thing, a song by Sean Colden, a song by Adam Ant, a song by Dag Nasty, Roger Wilco, a song by Young Money, Explicit, Jolly Roger, Roger and Out. Famous People Named Roger Roger Bresnahan, baseball player, Roger Moore, actor, Roger I of Sicily, Norman Ruler of Sicily, Roger Mayweather, boxer, Roger II of Sicily, Norman Ruler of Sicily, Roger McGinn, singer and guitarist for The Birds, Roger Waters, musician, Roger Craig, baseball player, Roger Vadim, French film director, Roger Bannister, first man to run the four-minute mile, Roger Williams, founder of Rhode Island, Roger Federer, tennis player, Roger Connor, baseball player, Roger Martin Dugard, Nobel Prize. Winner, Literature, Roger Meadows Taylor, drummer for Queen, Roger Maris, baseball player, Roger, Sid Barrett, founder of Pink Floyd, Roger of Worcester, English Bishop, Roger Avery, screenplay writer and director, Roger Penske, race car driver, Roger Nielsen, hockey player, Roger Bacon, English philosopher, Roger Andrew, drummer for Duran Duran, Roger Ebert, movie critic, Roger Daltrey, musician, Roger Clemens, baseball player, Roger Staubach, football player, 